everyone i am sejin from grade 6 brs global school bidar guppe karnataka india so today i have made a video of the robotics exhibition and the topic uh, the video project's name is bouncy balls so the first thing you have to do is type on google or google chrome code.org and after that if you are already signed in so no problem so if you are not signed in you will instead of my name you will get sign in you can click in sign in after that you should click on create and click on game lab so the first thing you have to do is click on rename and instead of this untitled project you should click on bouncy balls you can name it like whatever you want so i have after that you should click on save and you can delete the function block and put it back into the blocks area and then click on animation and you have to click on this add in new animation and then you can choose any of these and if you want you can draw on your own also and then after that you should click on emoji and then you can choose any of these emojis like smiley crying so i'll choose this and in this white block you should rename it as like whatever you want which is understandable and the next thing is you should add another one and you can again go to emojis and then i'll choose this and i will name it as G, uh, emoji 2 then you scroll down and there should be like minimum 3 and if you want you can do it even more than 3 so then i will choose next this one so i'll rename it as emoji 3 So now you are done choosing all the whatever you want, and you go back to the code. So the first thing what you have to drag and drop is the create edge sprite in the sprite block. So that prevents you like bouncing the ball like out of the boundaries. So that's a boundary cover for the emojis. So you can just search down for create edge sprites. then after that you should drag and drop word x value is equals to dash so that you will get it in variable and you should uh, drag and drop this so word x value is equals to whatever you have named the first emoji or the whatever shape you have choose so i have renamed it as emoji 1 and here you should drag and drop the create sprite 200 200 and if you want you can take this remove this separately and put it in that or you can just directly drag and drop this and just if you want you can delete this and you can directly instead of sprite you can just rename it as emoji 1 so you should do this for the rest too after that you should click on set uh, dash dot set animation dash so it's on the top most of the sprite block so both the sides you should name like the emoji one and the other side also emoji one so first side emoji one and even at the last i should rename it as emoji uh, sorry one and you should do the same for the other two so after that you should click on ball one set collider as circle which will keep uh, the shape as circle so you can choose this so i can you should type emoji one and after that you should choose the shape of the emoji that is circle and you should do the same for the rest too after you set the 
collider for these two two you should set velocity for these so first you should search uh, set velocity dash dash set velocity so instead of sprite you should again click on type mog1 and the velocity of the first one you can keep it as 10 and the second block it will be 5 and then the other one is um emoji 2 and set velocity 8 and 7 so here 8 and the other side 7 and for the last one you should set it as 6 comma 9 after that you should drag and drop the fun uh, you should click on the function block and drag and drop the first one this is function my function instead of my function you should click on draw and after that you should click on drawings and you should choose background color and drag it up under the function block so you can choose any background color so i will choose blue after that you should click on ball wind bounce off edges that if the ball comes uh, to the edges it should bounce to the another place and again to the edges and another place so it will be like that so you should go to sprite and search for bounce off sprite bounce off so then you should click on this and you should uh, type emoji one and then instead of the target like which target should it bounce off is the edges and then you have to do the same for the rest too so here is the three bounce offs and the next thing is on the world and in the world you have to search draw sprites so now we can just after that you should click on run and you get the bouncy balls bouncing off the edges and to the other corner to the other corner thank you